Welcome back to more of the Team Rant. And the first few walk through, here's the switch which opens the game, the water, where the artifact is. Now I can go in there to get the um, that artifact. Now near the end of this level is basically the boss fight. And the boss fight is basically um, the two centaurs. Now here, the, for this artifact, you want to be quick to get it. For a long swim. Get that caliber pistol ammo. Here you want to swim all the way to the end here. And you gotta climb out. Climb up onto the raft here. Here you want to pull the raft a little bit inward. And to grab the ledge. Now we're done with this cistern area. Now comes the, the other half, which is the, um, the tomb of Tinoken. Location. Go in this water here. You know, it gets sucked down just like so. And here we are. Don't forget the shotgun ammo that's here. Just want to check my health packs <clears throat> to see how many I've got. Swim in the water here, and you have to go through the tunnel. Go to this tunnel right here. Now when you swim up to, swim up to the surface and climb out, here is basically this location here. The same place from the original Tomb Raider. There's um, the entrance and there's those statues there. But also you want to go over here first. And to pick up the ammo that's over here. Also in the water is basically the, the other artifact. Plus a switch to pull, which opens the entrance to the Kala, to the, um, the Tomb of Tinoken. I can't pick up those items because I got too many with me right now. You want to swim faster here in the water. And here's the artifact. And by going to the, the status here, I got both the artifacts. All I gotta do now is make my, way, make my way back. You can use health, now for any reason that you start drowning, you can use a health pack, but don't use too many at once. I gotta go up to the surface to catch my breath here. <coughs> Don't use too many health packs at a time. The very first time I played this game, the boss fight with the centaurs, with these two centaurs, it really gave me, really gave me trouble. Here's where you go to find the switch to open the entrance to the Tomb of Tinoken. Now, unlike the T-Rex in the, um, the, um, the Lost Valley level, where you have to watch out for his feet, teeth, and when he swings his tail, here for the centaurs, you gotta watch out for their hooves, and watch out for the flames that they throw at you. You'll find out what I'm talking about for this boss fight. But yeah, also for, um, if for any reason I forget items, like I did in the previous level and the Lost Valley. I'll, I will replay those levels to get those missing items like the, um, that small health pack and of course the large health pack. For any reason that there's items I miss, like those health packs, I'll get those items but I'll get them off camera. I basically want to make up for what I missed. All I gotta do now is go through um, the entrance right over here. There's a cinematic and there's and for this next cinematic, more arrows appear on the screen. I just want to make sure that there's no items here before I make my way in there. Now 
Doesn't appear to be anything missing, and here's the cinematic right now. Here lies the god king Tihokan, one of the triumvirate, keepers of the three pieces of the skeel. Leader of the Chosen after the great betrayal caused Atlantis to be lost beneath the waves. Nothing. Look out from behind. You see, instincts can be expensive, mademoiselle. Yours are going to cost you both pieces at the ski on that's not a price I'm prepared to pay. Don't be absurd. No job is worth dying for. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. <laughs> Watch what happens here when he goes out of the tomb. Watch what happens here. Not so fast, Pierre. <laughs> nice try. Now on the screen here, now just like um, the T-Rex fight, on the top right hand corner of the screen, you basically see um, the same boss mirror, just like um, the T-Rex fight. And you'll see the same boss mirror for the last two later on in this game. Now here, for the centaurs, what you gotta do here is you wanna shoot them. Watch out for their flames, Ace, right there. You want to be, be careful not to be in the way of, their, of the smoke. It'll take less damage. And it's very easy to take damage from the smoke there. Now, usually when they light up like that, you want to be careful not to turn to stone. And it's very easy to turn into stone there. And that's what happens when they do that. When they um, use their hooves like that. Now, usually for the dodging headshots... You basically want to use, like, the grapple. And to get their shields. It may give you some trouble at first if this is your first time playing this game. And they really have a bad habit of trying to do that. I'm trying to use their hooves to kick to kick you and knock you to the ground. Okay, I don't know what that was about. And you want to be careful not to use too many health packs while at the same time trying to do this. This fight here. T-Rex fight where it's basically that rock you can stand on to defend yourself, to keep yourself safe. That um, platform's not here.
I'll shoot up more of these centaurs, but I'm gonna do it off camera. Cause it's taking me long it's taking longer for me for what I'm trying to do here. So I'll see ya um in more of this level, but I'll cut to the chase to where you see the ending cinematic for um this level. So I'll see you then.